doesn't make a lot of sense, but the command is the regen auto command. You can type in regen auto and change this value to off. And all that is going to do is turn off the auto regeneration in AutoCAD. Now this is super helpful for very large drawings, drawings where you have huge data sets or large imagery and XRefs within the drawing. Uh, this is particularly helpful in things like Civil 3D where you have tons of dynamic objects and you don't necessarily want the whole screen and AutoCAD regenerating every time you're doing something like switching between layout and model space, zooming in and out, customizing your viewports, that kind of stuff. So there are a lot of use cases where you'd want to turn off the auto regen command. Um, basically, it's just going to keep everything in AutoCAD looking the way it does. And then when you type in regen, it'll update and refresh everything in your views and layouts and that kind of thing. So this can just save you some compute power if you're working with a large drawing that's kind of struggling on your computer. That's probably the most useful case for this one. Next up, as we get close to the end of the list, is one that I use almost consistently within my drawings, and that is the select similar command. Uh, this is a right click command for the most part, but basically what it's going to do is select all of the objects with the similar properties, typically the layer and color, uh, as the initial object you've selected. So if I select this room tag here, it's on the room or note room layer. So right clicking anywhere once you've selected an object and clicking select similar is going to select all of these similar objects in the workspace.